Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. I have to wait till they all finish cheering. Cheer some more, everybody. <laughs> there you go. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> You don't, you, don't have, you don't have a shyness thing or a modesty <laughs> thing at all. Can you imagine? You like that. You like that a lot. How are you? You look I'm good. great. good. Thanks. I feel good. Yeah, you look terrific. I, I, I want to talk about something right here at the top, and then we'll talk about Saturday Night Live that you're hosting, which is, I think, really exciting. Yeah. I think it's going to be a great show. But I want to say the last time I saw you, Lisa and I have been friends for years. She may deny it, but we've been friends for like 10 years. Last time I was in Los Angeles, to do the Tonight Show, mm -hmm. I want to stop by and see you, so I stop by on the set right. of the movie that you're shooting with Mira Sorvino. Right. All right? And you had a little Game Boy that you were playing with. Yes. And at one point, you hand it to me, uh -huh. and you say, can you hold this while I shoot this scene with Mira Sorvino? Yes. So I suddenly become the nerd who holds the Game Boy <laughs> while you're shooting a movie. I have to put you in your place. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. It worked. All right. So I'm sitting there. No, she's right. I really hey, no. do. Oh. No, no, but I'm sitting there holding the Game Boy. Like, oh, I'll just, like, looking like a freak, just holding it while the big stars are doing their movie. And then I have to go, because i got to go to the Tonight Show, and the scene's going on for quite a while. So I put the Game Boy down. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, and I... <laughs> I you got to hear this, because this is a bit of a problem here. I put the Game Boy down, and I tell somebody, oh, that's Lisa Kudrow's Game Boy. i got to go if she needs it. I guess the person didn't work on the movie. And I cause a huge incident, because later I'm in Burbank. I'm about to do the Tonight Show. Like 40 people come rushing up to me and say, where is Lisa Kudrow's Game Boy? And it creates this huge, agents are involved, people are screaming, where is it? What have you done? Who the hell do you think you are? I was beaten up at one point. It was just this whole incident. I'm like, what was the big deal? It was my Game Boy. <laughs> <laughs> well, what? You know, I it's know, like. A, but I had also for like the next like two or three hours after you left, I had people coming up to me like, okay, we're trying to find your Game Boy. Um, <laughs> you know, like, really? Really serious, you know? It's like, right. we think we've trapped it to uh, Jay Leno. Uh, we've got someone on it, and I can't tell you how I, sorry I, I, I am. <laughs> I was like, all right. No, I, but I mean, it was like, this was, I thought, an indication of how successful you are, what a big star you've become. If I lose something, I could lose my spleen. I couldn't get anyone to go looking for it. You know, there'd be no one like, just find it yourself, all right? <laughs> yeah, Lisa that's Kudrow. a movie. Movies do that. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's such a much bigger deal. Yeah, on all the right. show, it's a little better. <laughs> <But> <laughs> wow. <laughs> all right. No, you do. That's so cool. It's, uh, everything's going well. And, yeah. Uh, I got to mention, uh, I, I want to talk to you because I've known you for so long, I, I met you. I didn't meet your husband for a while, you mm -hmm. know, because I didn't get out to Los Angeles. I finally met your husband. He's a really cool, nice guy. Yeah. He, his name's Michel. He's a Frenchman. Yeah. Yeah, but he's like, I, I didn't know what to expect. When I heard when you told me I married a Frenchman, I expected beret, That's he's right. riding a bicycle, he's wearing a striped shirt. <laughs> There's a big French roll in the seat, you know, and he's... And he does all that. It's, you know, he does no, that. He does. But, he walks yeah. with a big baguette all the time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's the real cliche. Uh -huh. Yeah. But he's, uh, and he talks like Pepe Le Pew, uh -huh. which I thought was really stunning. But what's he, he does seem like a very nice guy, though. He is. He's as sweet as pie. He's mm -hmm. great. He's great. And, and yeah, what? Things are going well, you guys? <laughs> oh, things are going great. It's, things are going really great. He's really happy. It's like now he can finally relax because. We got married, and now he gets his green card. Yay! And, um, <laughs> well, it's really stressful. I mean, he'd al he would always complain about how immigration is a very stressful mm -hmm. thing to deal with. And I, I would think, what a wimp. Come on. Just like, you know, big deal. Just <laughs> always, like, nervous about the big interview what do you mean, we big had. Big deal. Do. Big deal. You might get kicked out of the United States and never be able to return. What's your problem, yeah, wimp? Yeah. It is a big no, deal. But, but just like having to deal with these people, he'd always say, they're difficult. They're so mean to you. And, you know, like, oh, my God, you're so paranoid. I, you know, wouldn't validate it at all. Mm -hmm. So we go in for our meeting, and I'm just, he's really nervous, and I couldn't be more relaxed. I don't care. When's this going to be over? I have to go to work. Oh. Uh -huh. And uh -huh. we go in there, and they really are scary, mean people. Really? We sit down, and, and, the, and the man says, um, okay, so I need some ID, please. And he's just like staring sort of dead at you, like you're mm -hmm. about to pull something on me and I'm going to catch it. I'm like, oh, okay. So Michelle hands over his ID, and then I hand, my purse had just gotten stolen, so I didn't actually have a picture ID. And um, I said, well, I've got like a credit card and this stuff. And he's like, mm hmm, this is not the same name as your husband's. Right. I was like, no, I have to keep my name for my career. And he mm -hmm. was like, mm hmm, what would that be? And. <laughs> 
He and hadn't I, seen the show or anything? I guess not. I said, well, I'm an actor. And he's like, all right, whatever. OK. Um, <laughs> And I thought, wow, this is going to be really tricky. I had no picture ID. I, he wanted to see mail. The, my mail doesn't come to our address, so it doesn't even look like we have the same address. Mm -hmm. And I for, could not prove who I was, and he wouldn't believe it. And we finally whipped out like magazine articles and stuff. You know, <laughs> like we have this. And <laughs> <laughs> Here I'm on the cover of People magazine. Look at that. In the wedding gown, and he's with me. And, uh -huh. um, and the guy was just like, I'm sorry, what, what, oh, have I, would I have seen you in anything? I said, a TV show, Friends, and he went, oh, all right. Oh, I've seen that. Well, that makes things a little bit, well, okay. All of a sudden, it was like a party, and he had, <laughs> <laughs> he had like these, it's true, like this. Your friends theme kicked in and you were all dancing in a fountain, really? Yeah, we all became na 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 which means that's the musical word for friends now. Uh-huh. You don't have to say the word anymore, do you know that? No. Oh no, you don't have to say the word. You just go, oh well, yeah, no, I'm I we're close. We're, we've become really good. New, 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 new. You use that to communicate now with people? <laughs> oh, communicate in music. A new level of psychosis. All right, well let's talk about this. Saturday Night Live this week. This is this is great. You're perfect to do this. I knew you for years doing sketches in the Groundlings and uh -huh. everything like that. Uh -huh. I'm really excited you're doing it. Yeah, me too. Except what I realized is the stuff I did in the Groundlings mm -hmm. that doesn't, wouldn't work well on Saturday Night Live. It doesn't really? actually work well. What do you mean? Well, my characters were so, like, Saturday Night Live is like fun, broad, happy characters. All mm -hmm. my stuff was like, I did like, my favorite character was like an actress on a talk show. You know, I mean, I did that stuff. Right, which right. Which is, you know. And that's I not a good. Funny. That's not a good character for for Saturday Night Live. I don't think so. I, I mean, I just I thought it was funny at the time, but it's just kind of like you know, like a low key character who's just. Well, I'll do it for you if you want. Yeah, <laughs> let's see it. <laughs> so this is the name. So the name of the character is a, is is actress on a talk show. Yeah, I was very creative with my char character <laughs> names good too. Good name. Okay. Mm -hmm, uh -huh. But she was just really phony and like, hello, hello, oh hello, hello. <laughs> you know, that's all she would say. And like, yeah, it's been a long time since I've, you know, done anything, I guess. Um, but um, just because of the surgery I had. And thanks for all the cards and letters you sent. And um, really helped. It really did. <laughs> Thank you. You know, and then you just uh -huh. like pursue what, what happened to her, why she had surgery. And she's like, well, oh, all right. I had had a severe tonsillitis. <laughs> and no, uh -huh. and they had to, they had to actually remove both both of my tonsils. <laughs> yeah, no, it's hard. Uh -huh. It's about who am I now? You know, uh -huh. it's. Uh -huh. um, <laughs> you know, so this is a, you don't know how often I'm sitting here with people that are actually <laughs> like that. I know. I've always been afraid to. to yeah, think well, that's who I really am. That's what my life is like. All right. <laughs> this is. I'm really. I'm really looking forward to this. I think a lot of people are. Of course, Friends Thursday at eight o'clock on NBC. As if I had to mention it. And you're hosting Saturday Night Live this week with musical guest Cheryl Crow, and I yeah. think that's very cool. Yeah. Lisa, thanks so much for coming back. Thank you. We love having you, Lisa Kudrow, everybody.